block of ice or something like that. Good morning, you guys. It's been such a lovely day today. The sun is out. Um, we woke up kind of cold, but I can feel the warmth seeping in. I'm hoping my solar panels charge from this angle because my battery is like halfway over the night. So there's a lot of shade here and a lot of trees. So that's kind of not a good thing. I kind of want the sunlight to be seeping in, but we're gonna see how the day goes and hope for the best for our solar panels. I am so happy to be at our campsite. It took us hours to get here, and now that we're here, I am overjoyed with how beautiful this place is. We immediately got outside to play and started painting and drawing, and I noticed this is really something that keeps Kareem busy for quite some time. I like to have slow days where we just kind of keep ourselves busy with drawing and painting, and he really enjoys it.
Hello? Tisla. <laughs> I just want to take a quick second to discuss how I make weekdays easier as a single mom. I feel like being a single mom, my schedule is always so busy. Weekday mornings are normally really stressful, trying to get everything ready while also like trying to manage everything. So that I have found to help busy mornings is just allowing myself to take I already it moved my van three times today and it's only one o'clock. Sun is just hitting in so many different like spots in our campsite. So I'm trying to make sure my solar panels are charged. We need one more notch before it's fully charged and it's kind of stressing me out. I'll be pretty honest here, I get pretty tired. I mean, I make time and exercise and eat well and relax, but I completely get that I have a very busy life, even though I live in a van. I'm just sitting here basking in the sunlight and being around nature and just, just being very happy that we're here. <laughs> eight times to be exact and i am kind of stressed two more days here at this campground i did pay for this campground which it's very nice it has showers it has the restrooms it has trash which is really good not have sunlight i need sunlight i have solar so that's been a big problem i'm having can't keep moving it's already going to be 5 p.m i think what's going to happen is i'm just going to go back to my campsite I'm going to charge all of our devices while our batteries are okay and shut everything down for tonight. I may not have to do that. I may be being dramatic, but that's the overall plan. I just finished up dinner and it's about that time to go back to our camp spot. But this is van life reality for you. Worrying about when's the next time you're going to have electricity and if you're going to have enough electricity. So there's that. I think I'm going to leave this place on Monday and we're going to head to another campsite um, where it's more open and not so foresty. So it's looking like the desert. Being back in the van after traveling abroad, getting used to like hotels and Airbnbs and like, you know, the easy things. It's kind of a lot to be honest, so.
Okay, so Cream and I have just wiped down in the van. We have our sleeping clothes on. We're currently eating our fruit for our snack before bed. I'm gonna read Cream a bedtime story, and then we're gonna crawl into bed and watch a movie possibly, and call it a night. It is 7 p.m. We usually are in by 6.30ish, just because it gets really dark, and there's no need to be out that late, unless we're watching the sunset or we're around a fire or something. So yeah, so this is good night. I'll see you guys in the morning. Nine. Here she's tasking at what is called the Lucas Tower. Good morning. Good morning, you guys. Graham and I just woke up. I got breakfast going, and it feels really nice outside. We're literally in our pajamas. We'll probably go on a walk in a little bit, and have a good day. So how, how was your morning? How was your sleep? Yeah. Thank you. Oh, good. Let me see the birds. It's still everywhere, huh? Yeah. <laughs> and there's a campfire. Now I'm going to do it. The campfire? I'm going to do it. I don't know if we can do a campfire, babe. Living in a van, everything gets dirty pretty quickly, which I've stressed a numerous amount of times on my channel, and I think you guys get the picture, but it's actually very therapeutic when I do clean. I love having a clean space and a clean home, especially living in such a small space. It's very important that I keep my area clean so that my thoughts aren't jumbled and Kareem isn't losing his mind as well. And the shower was really nice. It was hot. It was only three minutes, so I just put in a quarter each. So we took a six minute shower. It's very fast. Cream and I are thinking of getting our tent out. As you can see, the sun looks like it's out, but I have no sun for my silver panels. Okay guys, Cream and I just got done playing in the meadows. We played basketball, we played tag, and what else did we play? We played soccer. Yeah. And we kept getting like those little pokey things in our feet. Yeah. So we were like, let's go back to the van. Have a good time. Mm -hmm. It is such a beautiful night today. I can't wait to get into the tent, zip it up, and lay down and watch a movie. We are looking forward to going to bed. We had such a beautiful day today. Kim and I are going to sleep in the tent tonight. It's not cold, but like I know in the morning when we wake up, it will be. I'm just making sure we're all 
bundled. He has on like four layers of clothes. I have on a few layers and we'll see you guys in the morning. Good night. Great. I like drawing get painting with you. Is it your favorite? Yeah. Good job. I, how'd you sleep? Good. Yeah? Did you have any crazy dreams today? I have one dream. Yeah, was it crazy? No, it was scary. It was scary? Yeah. <gasps> oh, Don't no. tell me Spirit Halloween and me and Nana. Let's add cozy wrinkles. You're saying something, man. You're the best mom ever. No, I love you. Okay. Oh, my. I kind of feel like I found a hack to make single parenting a little bit more easier just for myself. I like to really be present with my son and balance my van chores with working while also making time for myself and not feeling exhausted. I mean, I know finding the right daily routine as a single parent isn't always easy, so I finally feel like I have a schedule that works. Good morning, you guys. I haven't spoken to the camera much today. It is 12 p.m. now, so I'm gonna start cooking lunch. But I just wanna say, today's like our last full day here, and it's been so beautiful. Yeah, it's been super nice. Kareem has been loving it out here. Being used to being back in our home, just traveling until we get ready for our next overseas trip, which I'm super excited for. I'll see you guys while I cook. We're gonna make burgers today, I think. We're gonna play ball. We've been chasing each other around. And he's currently just showing me his new awesome moves. I wanted to drive to Colorado to check out Aspen, but that would have been so crazy considering like I'm leaving in a few weeks. So yeah, like look how beautiful that is. We are here and we're enjoying our time. Today's our last day. So we're gonna make the most of it. And we just playing together and trying to. Ah, that's so crazy! Ah, that's so crazy! <laughs> As always, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next fan video.